It's back on top now. Now this was, uh, you know, it was a, a tough game for you, especially in you know, the first half, a little yeah. bit of a slow start. I wanted to ask, I mean, you had a slow start last week. Did that experience kind of help you guys tonight, do you think? The, the slow starts never never actually worry any of us because we always know that our plays work. We know that we have the athletes to execute the plays. We just have to just give it time to work. And, you know, we got we stayed patient and we kept running our all. We kept running what we had to do. Our defense, once again, came in and played an awesome game, only letting up, what, eight points in the second half. And we were able to come out and do what everybody expects Spinoza to do. We were able to sling the ball around and we were able to move the ball down the field as we liked. And that's what we did because we trusted everything that we did. How important was it to get that first score right before halftime? Uh, that it was it was important. It was really important. I knew that I knew that if we can go in uh, down by four points or less, that we'd be great to go. Man, I was just able to see the nine route pop, and I just let it go. You know, number four is over there. He's a fantastic player, and you know he's always going to be there for me, and that's why that's why we're able to make it work. Yeah, how much of a weapon is it to have a guy like him on the outside? Uh, me and Dante, we've been he's a fantastic. We've been doing that since we were seven years old. We've been. We've been playing together forever. Like he was my first, my first best receiver, and we've been doing it for such a long time that it's just second nature for us. It's like, all right, my first guy is an open. If that's not my read, let's just find Dante because he's fantastic. He's a great guy. He's a great receiver. When you guys are down 10 nothing, like you said, that scoring drive, is there something as a quarterback that you kind of say, are you guys, you know, like, hey, you know, we got this one drive, we got to score right here before the half, or do you kind of just know your players have it? Uh, well, we know, we know we have it, but me being the quarterback that everybody expects me to be, I have to know that sometimes I have to take over. And, and I, I feel like I, I did a, a somewhat good job of being able to come in and really control that game. And so that's what I was really trying to do. I was just trying to come in and uh, control the game, try to take over a little bit. And I think that I did a pretty good job at that. Were, were they doing something early against you guys uh, to, to slow you down a little bit or was it just uh, a matter of finding, finding we just uh, had to fill them out a little bit they they uh we we uh the coaches did a great job of knowing what we were what they were going to do on film i we did our we did our homework and we just had to make sure that we, we just had to catch up to the speed of the game because we weren't playing very well and they only were, were up, they were only up on us by four points at halftime and offense wasn't playing a very good game and so we were able to come out and do and did what we had to do what well, we put up 22 points in the second half that's that's great that's what we need in championship runs do you feel like the game swung on that uh, block kick right there? And like, what was your emotion when you see, you know, all of a sudden it's blocked, and you know you're probably grabbing your helmet to get right on it? What was uh, your emotions in that moment? I was surprised, <laughs> but those quick turnarounds are when you have to be, you have to be great. That's whenever I realized, all right, we have a chance to drive down the field here, and we're gonna try to put the ball in the end zone. We did hit a few slant, hit a bubble. I ran for a little bit, and we punched <laughs> it in. So that was that was probably my favorite drive of the game. I'll probably never forget that one. Heck yeah! And then just one last question is, you know, you win a Whitfield championship, but the job's not done. You know, what do you have in store moving forward? Uh, more the same. We're going to come out. We're probably hopefully going to play some better first halves in these next few games, but we're going to keep coming on. We're going to keep fighting. We're going to keep going. We're going to keep trying to win games. Awesome.